hi in this lecture i will teach you model this uh, chair this chair only so let's start see the model first uh, this is uh, make uh, from pipe and uh, back side uh, vertex uh, will be uh, scale and some edges at uh, at uh, front side and some edges at back side so this will create and for shape we can adjust this shape like uh, rectangular round and rectangular so i am uh, searching the pipe extrude it and uh, rotate it like this and uh, rotate uh, x y z so z axis minus 90 minus 90 so it will be rotated now uh, scale is good some make some scale and uh, right click and vertex select back side vertex and uh, scale and uh, but now undo i i don't need these segments these these are 20 segments we need only this type segment and right click and vertex select vertex and uh, scale check the here make it look like this and make a scale and uh, w press down side and uh, press 3 right click and object mode press 3 it will looks like this it's good but uh, pipe thickness is not good press 1 select one edge uh, go to mesh tool insert edge loop at here inside also outside here and uh, here it will take automatically and now press 3 now it's good for roundity but we don't need roundity so go to vertex select this vertex and this vertex this vertex this vertex and this vertex make it uh, scale uh select these two vertex scale like this select these two vertex we shift key and uh, scale like this and select this and select this scale 
select this and select this scale so now it shape match with the our object and now make the pipe right click and object mode now go to top and uh, make a pipe look at the pipe pipe is going here after here after here and here so uh, uh, go to top and select a cylinder like uh, this and give height go to perspective and set it here and uh, we don't need this top segment so go to parameters and uh, cap 0 and uh, make it uh, radius 0 0.29 0 0.24 0 0.2 this is good and uh, control D duplicate and uh, rotate this control D and rotate this by J key and uh, select set it here and uh, Uh, select this, these two and uh, select this and duplicate this control D duplicate and uh, select uh, three and go to mesh combine and right click and face select this face also select this face and uh, bridge this is bridge but now it is linear select it blend now good now select this tool now select the face now click bridge and blend now this is ready but uh, stand is like this so we use uh, cone uh, this is cone and uh, rotate this press J give it uh, minus 90 uh, minus 180 set this scale and go to top
set it here go to side set it here <coughs> <coughs> sorry press f set it here this type and uh, also control d set it here f and now select whole three objects go to mesh and combine scale this now right click and uh, object mode scale this scale uh, these are not uh, connected mesh combine and scale select this and go to top and check the but this is uh, something the that side so right click and uh, vertex select vertex move this select this vertex and move this now right click and uh, object mode now go to top and take it downside now go to perspective it's good and uh, control d take it back side but it should be rotate like this and uh, scale like this so set this here and select this and set it here and uh, scale this like this and uh, make a pillow from box go to top and uh, make a box go to perspective and uh, press 3 uh, go to mesh tool and uh, insert edge loop from here from here and from center and from center here and press 3 and uh, right click and vertex set the vertex uh, check the image let it down and uh, scale right click and uh, object mode scale it and both side scale it check the image right click and vertex shift and scale like this move it right click and uh, object mode go to top set this and uh, move this upside like this so now chair is ready
and uh, material is normal so i am giving color right click assign new material and fongi control a okay okay control a fongi and uh, select uh, color light blue okay see the chair is ready so now i am saving this file for you and closing this lecture thanks